Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're learning about factoring quadratic expressions. Minute Math, Minute Math, when you need help to use Minute Math. We're given this problem right here. For what values of b is the expression factorable? And we have the expression x squared plus bx plus 12. Well, we first want to start with our c value 12. What numbers well, multiply to be 12. That's 1 and 2. Or sorry, not 2, 1 and 12. <laughs> 2 and 6. And, well, 3 and 4. But other pairs that multiply to be a positive 12 could be a negative 1 and negative 12, negative 2 and negative 6, and negative 3 and negative 4. So this list is actually important to find our b value because we know when we factor to normally it'd be what time or what is it uh, what two numbers multiply to be 12 but add to be a b value here but we don't know what our b value is but we know it could be because we define all the possible values we have the list of all the numbers that multiply to be 12 so we have to add every single one of these pairs one plus 12 is 13 two plus six is eight and 3 plus 4 is 7. Can't forget the negatives. Negative 1 plus negative 12 is a negative 13. Negative 2 plus negative 6 is a negative 8. And negative 3 plus negative 4 is a negative 7. And so actually here, we have all of the possible b values for this expression. 3, 13, <laughs> not 3, 13, 8, 7. Negative 13, negative 8, and negative 7 are all possible b values that make this expression factorable, and that's our final answer. I hope this video was helpful for you, and if it was, please subscribe to this YouTube channel and like this video. This helps us make more free math lessons for you and for everyone else. So as always, thanks for watching. Minute Math, Minute Math, when you need help you use Minute Math.